but I'm so sad. Yeah, I'm so sad that. Hey, lovelies. So yeah, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. Yes, um, my name is Happiness. Just in case you will see my face for the first time. And welcome to my channel. And please do make sure you hit the subscribe button. Yeah. So um, first of all, I'm really sorry about my voice. I got cold and I've been coughing and yeah, it affected my voice. <coughs> well, I'll try to be audible as much as possible. <coughs> so yeah, um, if this video ever goes up on my YouTube channel, then this will be the first time I'm ever being vulnerable. The first time I'm ever being vulnerable here on YouTube because <laughs> I'm not <laughs> yeah like if you know me so well not like know me bore if you know me so well and you know me so deep you will know that I keep a lot of things private a lot you guys might feel like I'm showing you things for Mm, you're not even seeing anything at all but yeah if this video again if this video ever goes up then this is the first time I've ever been vulnerable here on YouTube and I think yeah it's okay because by God's grace I've been able to build a lot of family members here you get we are more than I don't know how I don't want to say 3,000 right now because I don't even know when this video is going to come up. Maybe when it's going to come up would be when we are 10,000, 20,000. I don't know because I really do not know when I'm going to upload this video. But today is January 17th, 2021. Yeah. So I think it's, it's okay to be vulnerable here on YouTube because I already see you all as my family members. Yeah. So now this is it. Um... I've been having breakdowns for some days now. I don't even know if that is the reason why I felt sick. I don't know for yeah I have. <coughs> and I'm going to explain to you all why. <laughs> uh, I don't have any script or anything because I really wanted to talk from my heart, like from my heart. Okay, so you just have to pay attention so you can get where I'm going to, okay? So yeah, um, last year, 20, I think I said 2021 earlier. No, today's date is January 17th, 2022, yeah. So last year, 2021, I moved into my place here, this beautiful apartment. Yeah, um, I don't even know where to start from. And um, if you don't know, I'm a student here in the Philippines, taking up my master's in business administration. And um, I just wrote my comprehensive exam. Yeah, as I now, I'm waiting for my results, but I believe in my heart that by the time this video is going to go up, my results should be out and I pray and I declare in the name of Jesus that I have a high pass. I did not feel any subject. Yeah. So amen. So yeah, um I moved into my own place here in the Loyolo City and um you know I'm currently waiting for my results and um <laughs> I don't know how to do things like this, trust me, but we move. Um, okay, so now the, the, the main thing here is why I'm having the breakdown actually is because I'm to move to Manila. Yeah, I have to move to Manila for a lot of reasons, but most importantly because of my business. So I realized that in Manila I have more customers for Happy Crusade than I have than I have here in Iloilo. I have customers here in Iloilo, but uh, I have more customers in Manila than I have in 
you know, you know, right? And you know, this year we are securing the bag and all that, so we've got to work hard. Anyhow, um, I'm to move to Manila. It's been, it's been there since last year, 2021. Or well, whenever I think about it, I'm always scared. Now, the, 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 the truth is, I'm an introvert, but a lot of people do not believe or do not accept that because I'm like, <laughs> actually, I'm an ambivert, but more of an introvert, actually. So, the thing is, I love my space. <laughs> I love my space. I love. I love Iloilo city because it's quiet, there's no, the Nigerians here, we are not up to 10 as at today, because a lot of them are going back home, a lot of them went to different countries and some are currently in Manila and all that, in fact, I think we are just three, two Nigerian girls here in Iloilo, but that's by the way, so, um, I love my space. I don't like Manila. I mean, if you've if you've heard me talk about Manila, or you will know that I'll keep saying that I don't like Manila on a serious note. And uh, but I really have to move to Manila. I really have to move. I don't want to. I really don't want to on a serious note. I don't want to go to Manila. And. Um, the decision is just so, like, it's, it's a hard one, a very, very hard one for me, because <laughs> to even think that I got the, the best house, like, this house is the best house I've ever stayed in, like, this house is so perfect, <coughs> who knows, maybe I'm going to put a short clip. It's currently scattered right now because I'm packing my things, you know, I'm not sure you all. But my house is so perfect. Like, it has this big room, it has this kitchen, it has a toilet, and it's just a perfect house for me, you get. And then I made the house in a way that, <laughs> that like, whenever I'm outside, I always want to be home. Like, my my space my place my comfort like a place i find peace in a place i always want to be in that is the way i i don't know what i'm talking about my house but yeah that's like the main thing that is making me break down is so sad and um, right now it's really just so hard to move to manila i don't like manila manila life so crowded for my kind of person there's so many people there to crowd it, but I have to go there because of, yeah, happy Christmas. And, um, yeah, and I'm just so comfortable here that it's so hard to leave my comfort zone. So, like, how, how I'm feeling right now is, you know, just like, I'm so, like, you know when people would, when motivational speakers would always be like, you have to leave your comfort zone, you have to leave your comfort zone, I can't say all that, you have to leave your comfort zone and all that stuff. I thought I knew what that meant though. Sorry. I thought I understood what leaving your comfort zone was. But sincerely, I didn't understand and I didn't know how hard it was living your comfort zone until now that I had to be really living you know, for Manila. You get God. Sometimes when I just sit or when I'm about to sleep and I just think about it, I'm like, oh God. You know, I've cried, I've prayed, I've ask for cancel and all that stuff and everybody just everybody's like yeah that's the best thing you have to do so yeah I just have to do it 
I, I just have to do it. I'm not doing it because, you know, I, I feel like, or I like it. No, I'm doing it because it's the best thing to do. Not that I feel like it. And um, the reason I even got to the point where I, I had the courage to go ahead to book my ticket and all that is because God has my back in in this. Um, yeah. But I'm so sad. Yeah, I'm so sad that I'm so sad that I'll be leaving you know you know like really I'm so sad yeah sorry you know I just have to I just have to make a decision because I really cannot it's not like I can't stay here forever right someday I'll be going back to Nigeria so would I be doing this right I have things I have to achieve I have goals I have to meet and all that so I really cannot be doing this but I'm so scared of leaving my girlfriend so at this point I don't want to cry because I've cried a lot about moving and like you know just just that thought of going to a different place going to meet different people I can't stand it I just wish there was like a better way if there was a better way, I promise I wouldn't be doing this. <coughs> I can't believe this, really. Like, I really cannot believe this. Or, I'm just, I'm telling myself that I'll be coming to, uh, to Lelo at least once a month to stay for a week and by God's grace, I intend to, you know, to um, have the Outreach of Open Life Foundation here, you know, you know, more of it. Oh, I'm going to miss my church. Yeah, I'll miss my church. I'll miss my friends. Like, I wish you all really, I, I wish I could really explain deeper or I could talk more on what's really in my heart oh, I'm sorry I'm not just like that <laughs> yeah I'm really not like that <laughs> I find it very difficult sharing things really <laughs> before I share things before I tell like I could be going through something right now you wouldn't know until I put my mother in Tell you. Oh. God. What the fuck am God, I don't know. I don't know what my future holds for me. But I know who holds my future. I know that it is you, Abba. But you know everything, you know my heart, you know how I feel right now. You know how difficult this is for me. You know how difficult this is. How difficult making this decision is for me. You know, but I'm just so confident in you that you are leading me. I'm so confident that I'm walking in your will and in your purpose. Oh, 
oh God, I'm asking that Father, you would go before me. You make the way straight for me, Lord Jesus. The Lord, the Lord of Manila is going to favor me, to favor happiness we see. It will favor Hope Life Foundation. It will favor my YouTube channel. It will favor me. I declare I walk in favor. I walk in ease. I flourish. I walk in abundance in the name of Jesus. But let your will be done, not my will, but let your will be done. I declare I will not have any difficulties. I come against every distraction, every temptation, every trials in the name of Jesus. I don't know, you guys. Like really, this is the only thing I can just do is just to pray and ask God to lead me. Really, because I don't know. It is well. It is well. <laughs> I just thought that my going to my life is close. It's Ah, <laughs> Just the thought of my going to my lab in this closes. Ah, hell God, Come and help your daughter, Jesus. Hey, God, Rado Sata Leketera. Ah, Jesus. <laughs> God, oh, Abba, Abba, oh. you guys do not understand. Oh, the Manila, oh, hey, would you thank God? Oh, hey, <laughs> oh, God. I'll be all right. I'm a strong girl. Hey, strong girl. My eyes are peppering me. Actually, I'm grilling chicken. I'm making grilled chicken here. So I don't even know if that one is added to. Ew. Happiness, I'm so proud of you. Really so proud of you. I know that you're not alone. Okay. Happiness, you will be fine. Happiness, you will be fine. Okay. You'll pull through this. Trust me. You will. Yeah. I'll miss my house. I'll miss his house. Oh God, I miss my house so much. Oh, this house is so beautiful. There is no party that has entered my house that has not said this house is so nice. <coughs> Thank you, Lord. I know you're working all things together for my good. You are making ways where there seems to be no way. Abba, you are doing it. You've done it before. And you will do it again. Let me end this video. Thank you all for watching. If I finally upload this video, just send me money. Send me. Just put you just comment. Send me your account number. Send me your account if I upload this video. <laughs> God help me. Full I don't want to that. That is. Hey, Rada Lebro Satali Kade Sharabo Satali Kadeda. 
Ah, my steps are ordered by the Lord. I am not confused. I have clarity. I have divine direction from the east, the west, the north, and the south. Rebosa talikidera rada sharabos. Ew. Bye bye. God bless you all. Love you.